Uh, cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Thank you for inviting us. Thank you. My name is Jan. I'm uh, originally from Germany, but I lived in San Francisco for the past five years. And uh, yeah, we we just arrived here two days ago. We're gonna spend a month here, um, and it's been great so far. I'm Corwin. I am from Texas originally, and then I've been in the Bay Area for the last ten years. Um, where I met this one, and I've just wanted to come to Japan and India since I was a little girl, and it's my first time. Do you guys eat uh, Japanese food in the, in the States? Or? Yes, yeah? absolutely, absolutely. We have actually. In San Francisco, where we used to live, we had a very favorite, our favorite uh, Japanese sushi place. It was fantastic. Like we went there all the time. Maybe shabu shabu. You find that too. In San Francisco, we had a shabu shabu place, which was actually pretty good. Yeah. Seaweed. Okay. With the uh, vinegar. It's really, it's really clean and fresh. It's delicious. Yeah. This really isn't like tuna that I've had before. Yeah. Yeah. Like almost, it's really tender but almost meatier in a good way. Like the tuna that I know is. It's like low fat tuna. <laughs> oh, okay. That's true. And it, it definitely feels fresh. It's yeah, it's a bonito. bonito. Oh, yeah. This is your first time to try like a raw shrimp. Raw shrimp, I think so. I don't think I've ever had it. I've never had raw shrimp. Oh, really? Yeah. 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 I gotta take a photo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna take a photo. Yeah. First time. <laughs> It's sweet. It's sweeter than I would expect. Yeah. Yummy. Yeah. 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 It's very soft. It tastes very different than when it's cooked. That's for sure. It's wasabi. Wasabi. <laughs> it's, real, it's real wasabi. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this one is sake from Niigata Prefecture. Niigata? Niigata is pretty famous. Cheers. Cheers. It's good. It's really good. We lived in San Francisco until end of April and we packed up our stuff and uh, decided to basically live abroad for a while. Okay. And what we did is we went, spent some, a couple months now in, in Bali. Now we're gonna be here for almost two months in Japan, one month in Tokyo. And then uh, we're probably gonna go back to the United States for a bit, but we're just gonna continue like living and working in other places. That's the thing. <laughs> It's also beautiful, I think. It's alright. Have you been? I, I've never been, but uh, you know, like there are, there are so many like uh, startup companies, Silicon Valley and uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. good universities, Stanford universities, and uh, there are so many people who want to try to open the business. And, it's I, very good for that. It's very, yeah, very good. For yeah. That. It's a very, yeah, very startup and entrepreneur friendly environment. You guys do work with the uh, like startup startup companies in Silicon Valley? Or? Uh, we, we used to. So I um, that's what brought me out there, right? Yeah. 
I, uh, I started a company with two friends of mine and we, we came out to San Francisco because of that. Internet or, or technology related, it's, it's really the best place. And then, um, and then I used to work for, for Dropbox for the last three years. Oh, really? Yeah, and you, you guys, in Japan, Japan yeah, likes okay. Dropbox. Yeah, yeah, I know, yeah. Germany too. We've also been working in tech for the last many years. Um, and I'm working with a couple of clients currently um, doing some software engineering for them and a little bit of design. In her case, for instance, she's now doing engineering work for a company in, in Redwood City in, in, uh, in Silicon Valley. Uh, and uh, today she had to work, and we spent a lot of time in a cafe, and like she had to work like properly, and she didn't get to you know experience Tokyo as much as she would like to. But it's still it's, it's a wonderful yeah. thing because this allows her to be here yeah, yeah. to have like she's the evening here and like. You know, to have a meal like in Tokyo, right? You know, instead of in San Francisco, which we already know. Pretty well. Yeah. Good thing There's about you know having a business with internet is like when, yeah. wherever you go, you can still work yeah. at any place. That's I think it's a uh, dream job for me. We can't get over Japan. I was saying my cheeks hurt because I've been smiling so. Much. <laughs> uh, everything is just so it's nice. Amazing. Everything is like clean, organized. It's just. People are nice and kind and like generally kind of like... I was prepared for surprises, which is a really weird thing to say, but I was prepared for like... Amazing <laughs> cultural customs, everything, but when we stepped out of the subway station, the most surprising thing was that it was so quiet. Uh, oh yeah. Here. yeah. And it's so real. Cool. It is amazing. No, but it's, it's just... I don't know how to describe any other metropolitan city. Okay. It would be just like loud and... Red snapper. Weird. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, washing. Washing? Yeah, washing. They have like another branches in okay. Tokyo. Uh, when I come to Shibuya, I uh, meet up with my friends and sometimes I come here to drink. It's like a local menu. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no corners. Yeah. Good. Thank you for the tip. Yeah. We need more more tips like this. All Japanese food is incredible. I have yet to meet a meal that yeah. okay. is not disappointed yeah. in the slightest. It's amazing. Oh, are you satisfied with the food you ate today? Very, very satisfied. Yeah. Yeah. No meat left. No, nothing is left. Yeah. Yeah. How about you? It was so good. It was incredible. Yeah. The, like very fresh. Yeah. Okay, I'm glad that you enjoyed yeah, Thank you so much. Today. That yeah. was really, that was a great experience. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you very much. <laughs>